The Queen and Prince Charles have allegedly put a stop to Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's plans to set up their own global philanthropy brand separate from the royal family, according to sources. The soon-to-be parents wanted to create their own Sussex brand that was completely independent from the royal family, according to online gossip magazine Page Six. A royal source told The Sunday Times, they wanted their household to be entirely independent of Buckingham Palace, but were told no. They can't just go off and do their own thing. Instead, the Sussexes will have their own separate offices away from the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge but will still be under the royal family. The couple are planning to focus on their own causes and initiatives, seeking to diverge from the path of William and Kate. The changes will take place this spring when Meghan and Harry are also due to move into Frogmore Cottage and have their first child. The former Suits actress may turn to close friend Victoria Beckham for tips on how to make her philanthropy appealing for a wide audience. The two women became friends after their husbands introduced them to one another. They now regularly bump into each other at the private country club near their Oxfordshire retreat, according to the Daily Mail. Meghan has also been seen sporting clothes from Victoria's fashion line. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex also hired Hillary Clinton's former campaign adviser Sir Latham to help the couple with their future initiatives. The separation of William and Harry puts the Royal Foundation at risk, which they both helped set up in 2009. The foundation has produced several prosperous initiatives which include the mental health campaign Heads Together and the Invictus Games which gives wounded injured and sick military personnel the chance to compete in a competitive sports competition. The separation of the two couples has also sparked more rumors about a royal rift between Kate and Meghan, especially as the two duchesses differ in many ways. A royal source has previously described the sisters-in-law as very different people with different styles.